Hello, fellows. <sighs> so I... We're doing some thinking. Painful, but not fatal. And I think uh, I'm going to really try being offensive. In as far as... I've got some Quan here. I'm gonna... I can't remember why they're here, actually. I think I've fought and defended with these guys. Yeah, oh yeah, that was my good hill defense fight, or I thought it was good. And then this is like a remnant of it, that defeated foe. So what I think I'm going to do is take this stack here, come fight, because I mean they're all nubbin units and everything, but their units are good, but they're all fairly decimated. Um, and I do have a horse, unlike the last fight with these guys, no horse. Oh, they're diseased. Die with that, with the disease. Oh, it's a morale hit, isn't it? Yes. You see that? Morale, because they're diseased. But... I'm sick of this back and forth, because if I wait one turn... Well, first off, I also thought, too, instead of attacking their food, because obviously that's not causing them any grief, because they rebuild it, I wonder, well, I mean, it'll probably be the same thing, but they also have a, uh, what is that there, the red, uh, it's some sort of workshop that enables them to get units, maybe what I have, yeah, that's what I have, it enables them to make their versions of Spear Brothers and other various units, if I sabotuski it, instead of, um, sabotaging their food, maybe they will not be able to make freaking ten units per turn, and if they do, they'll just be garbage. So I will try that. Well, no, since I'm going to attack, I've decided. I'm going to attack now. So I'm going to use Siggy Pop. I am looking at you, Sig Hild, you glorious woman. So she will be in charge of morale killing. And he, White Wolf, shall be in charge of garrison weakening. Will they be successful? Let's find out. One for one. Now let's see. Yes, he's good at this. So I will just... A lot of times these are like... In, the first one is like an innate... It's like an innate... Uh, skill. Like you... It comes... You come with like level one of this one thing. Um... And there's various, I mean, you can pick, like when you build an agent or a general, it, you hover over and it tells you what this innate thing is, and some of them are totally dumb and some of them are cool. And so whatever, I try to first of all pick agents that I like what they come with naturally, instead of, and this guy came with, uh, White Wolf came with, he came with this one, which is Herbalist meaning poisoning and you know so I'm gonna encourage him to do that ooh do we remember how I said I was gonna use Sighild Siggy Pie was gonna go back to the army because of her ridiculous inherent war master bonus 15% melee attack skill for all units in the army 12% morale for all units in the army that might be key right now because they're diseased up here they're filthy diseased bastards so they might, I don't know how quickly that'll make them route. But anyway, anyway, what do we got? What is this? You know what I'm going to do instead, though? I'm going to... It's a, one of those risk things, so... I'm going to... Not assault their garrison. I just wanted to see what they have. It's all these... Yes! Remember when I... Oh, Celtic tribes men and not tribes man. Merman. Tribes man. <laughs> if you don't get my references, just uh, please pretend like they're cool. So here's a full on general. I'm going to. What is this harass? Impedes the melee and range combat potential, but she has no chance of doing it well. Do you see this? How I was talking about last time? Actual percent listed, 76, and the tooltip, they match. Positive outcome percent, 76. 
So this tooltip is not necessarily always right we found because last time I, she tried one that said up here it's on the 76 that I'm circling it said she only had a 20% chance but when you hovered over it said the actual chance was 76. So now I'm figuring out that you have to actually take a second and look because they're not guaranteed to match. So creative assembly, there you go. Anywho, I'm going to try to smite their noble horse. That's probably true, Siggy. So now, look at that, he's decimated. He's really hurt, so now he will be much less of a factor and hopefully he will rout much quicker and die easier. Before I do that though, so that's, this is set up for invasion. The fact that, uh, you know, I don't, what I should do, honestly, oh, I don't have any, oh, I do have money. What I should do, mercenary warriors. What I should do is, <laughs> why do I always do that? I don't know. It's just too fun. Uh, I don't have anything better, and they're all just as... You know what I should do? I should scratch these three and recruit these three. Even though their upkeep's ridiculous. Mm, they do have a three rank. Because you got to remember, there's going to be 6,000 garrisoned units in here, not just the armies that are listed. So I want to have as many... No Alright, I'm just going to try it. So now I'm going to recruit... I'm going to hire... I'm going to move here. I'm going to hire... Three Broskis. So now my army at least is more number wise filled out. Let's go. And of course, you know, I'm, I'm sick of waiting. This is never going to be in my favor because of freaking Ambi Turners. Ruin everything. So, hmm. let's go. Lang Siege. Minus 20 morale, gotta keep that in mind, even though there's not much I can do about it. Is there? Is there? Alright, let's go. Dunce caps. Oh, you sad, sad. The, oh, the enemy sallies out to fight on the field. That's wise of them because they were all in fish in a barrel style before. If you're going to make a flanking move, try to pick a route where your chances of victory are higher. Thank you, Tooltip. Thank you. I will just start. Okay, so. They have sallied me, and there is their salliness. But we do have reinforcement. This is the minority of the army. The majority is coming out. So where do I want to be for max, for fast, effective relief? I want to be, this is all, look at this, open, 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 open. So I guess I'll be... Uh, sure, somewhere over here. Maybe the same kind of thing before that I tried, except not be retarded ridiculously foolish with my Yanaral. Who was that? Frederick that I blatantly lost by foolishness? Oh, that still hurts to think about emotionally. Okay, so let's see. You boys shall skirmish, but you will st you two will start see. You two will start and then that's incorrect. You three will start here. You shall come up. Germanic youths. Look at the range. Look at that range. Look at that. How do they, I mean javelin men? I mean I guess they cause damage much more, but still it drives me nuts. 
Noble riders. We shall shield up. We shall glow. Oh, we shall not shield up. Who doesn't shield? Who's not shielding? What's going on? Mercenary shields cannot. Mercenary bros can't shield screen because they're mercenaries. That is so okay. So they'll be my flanking force then. I'll just put one over. Here. That's ridiculous. Stop with that. We don't get paid enough to use shield screen. That's so s silly. So, the rest of you, legit military, go ahead and, uh, so you flankers, you flanker, and commence. And fast forward it, fast forward it. I shall admire the, enemy reinforcements approaching. shut your mouth. That is true. They have a thousand men reinforcing, or what was it, seventeen hundred men? But they're all uh, ambi turners that we're reinforcing, so I'm not too worried about them, unless they reinforce from this general direction. That would leave a mark. So uh, let's see what they do. Again, I could totally, I could really get flanked here still if they. Uh, do this activity, but could and will not the same thing. And again, for like sometimes with my flanking forces, instead of having them f flared out all the way here, it kind of it just seems to me that it encourages the enemy to attack from further. So I sometimes I'll have them stationed like right here because it kind of you know it encourages the enemy to kind of pinpoint and since they pinpoint here I can then come around and then come around and then administer death with who is this with Gisbert that name alone brings death Gisbert so but I think I'm going to cause, but since these are on foot smashers they're kind of a pain to move around so I'll just try to have them at the flare, at the ready. Where the haze? Oh, they're probably getting orange mocha frappuccinos. Meanwhile, I fast forward. And meanwhile, also, tick tick. I do like the 20 minutes. I like the 20 minutes um, on, on myself to when attacking, because otherwise I'll sit there paralysis by analysis and I'll just sit there forever before I it's like a flaw of mine as a human where I like to I'd rather just not make a mistake than do anything you know I'd rather not do anything than do something wrong I would rather sit there and try to have everything figured out before I even try anything that way I'm that's just a failing of mine so this stuff like this as ridiculous as it sounds these kinds of games help me with that where I so I like artificially will put constraints on myself to get me out of the I think it's a bad habit paralysis by analysis I mean depending on what you're talking about but anyway that's a little about me which I mean whether you know it or not you are now a better person for knowing more about me that's kinda how I am I enrich you by describing me. Oh, that was all tongue in cheek. Nice <laughs> nice bird you've caught there. He looks hungry. He kinda looks walking uh, Again, oh yeah, again if you remember a few episodes ago, the S arm. Shop smart, shop S smart. You all kind of, I mean, you're cool, but you're so uniform looking. I do, oh, that's another mod I wish was working, was the, uh, there's a guy, someone has a mod where it's like a total, 
randomizer, not blatantly random, but really is cool. Like, it really breaks up the unit, so it's not just a block of whatever this is, burgundy, maroon. You know, really, but it's totally unfinished, and I was using it in Egypt. Where are they at, by the way? Nowhere to be found. They're having a walk-off somewhere over that way. It's a walk-off. Um, but yeah, this unit mod... The, you know, it's not doesn't mod stats, it just mods appearance. All the stuff I have are appearance mods. But that one that I wish was working, all the most of the infantry looked outstanding, but the <laughs> the Noble Rider Egyptian version was actually missing, so the guys would just float around <laughs> without the horses weren't in. And so they would like ghost ride, you know, which was in a way kinda cool, but I was like, oh man and there's a couple units here or there where the units themselves were missing, and so they would be, you know, it was just incomplete, and I was like, uh, and I don't really, I don't know that many people that sit here up like this when they play this game. I mean, you set your thing, you move your army pieces, and then when you want to watch them fight, I can sometimes come in close, but only like during a replay, I can't do that in real time. Unless I'm doing mop-up duty, but then usually by the time it's mop-up duty, I guess they don't even want to fight. This is ridiculous. I've never had this happen, actually. I've had it where they're like, we'll sit out here for like, down to eight minutes, and then it's a bloody eight minute, it's a bloodbath. But I've never actually had it where it's run out of time. I will lose? Oh my god, I'm attacking, and they sallied out. Not gonna lie, that's pretty humorous. <laughs> I attacked them and they sallied out. Oh. That is outstanding. How ridiculously stupid. That is amazing. Yes, I read that just as the enemy is coming out to attack you. I'm like, oh, okay. Of course I'm attacking. They had to sally out from their freaking town, which I'm attacking. This guy better gain a trait as Dumas or something. That was so ridiculous. And he's out of... Oh my, that is bad. We learned that the mercenary Spear Brothers are totally useless. Oh, well... Get out. That was so bad. Alright, well let's... A quick recap. I welcome you, worthy speaker. Trade. Just do it. Produce your timber and share it. We will even give you military access. And Quan. I will give you 500 Quan. You're a punk, sir. Horse ranch. What else we got going on here? And see, I don't know either. Is that... Mm. There's a lot of things I don't know, as you can see. I don't know when I'm attacking or defending. I, that confuses me sometimes. I do like the philosophy. Growth, growth is good, good, good. Let's try, uh... What do we got going on here? Let's try the philosophy. Because this just gave me the ability to make... Light horse, I believe. What kind of horse can I make? Be more specific. Level 2 horses upon recruitment. 
100 wealth from one. Oh, see, so yeah, you don't actually get units. You just get the ability to have better units if you sh should make them later. It doesn't give you actually horse units. It's like if you do make horse units because of your other military buildings, the ones you do make will be better. That makes sense. Not gonna lie, it really does make sense. That's pretty cool. What's the end all be all here? What are we talking about at the end? That doesn't seem that good. Minus 6% upkeep for all armies. Cheaper armies, cheaper armies, and you can recruit more. But that's... That just doesn't seem that good. I remember their bonuses being... different. Anyway. I don't have any culture. They're barbarians. Hmm, nebs. I guess I'll just do this one then. I give up. Alright, I'm out of time as well, so thank you for watching me be a Duma with this attack. I will. Well, now they're all rebuilt, so we'll see. I'm sure I'll get attacked. Anyway, I will see you next time and have a good one. Take care. Bye.